All right, we're here with Michelle and Deliche, and this is the island right here, folks, for all of you back home. And we're at the campground right up here. We're gonna exactly. go out to the pier, and you got the nice beach, a lot of cool activities around here. Michelle, tell us about this campground, pretty cool. Uh, we have 179 campsites. We have, that fit up to 45 foot, and also we have some that are pull-throughs, and we have back ends as well. Nice, free internet too, right? Free internet, Wi-Fi, um, full hookups, you name it, we got it. <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> now the island's pretty awesome, right? So the beach and all the different activities. We did the light show, that was pretty cool overall, but uh, what's your favorite part of the island? Um, I like St. Andrew's Beach, Yeah. sunset. Okay, oh, that's the place to go. Got another great video for you this week from how to have fun outdoors that's right Jekyll Island boy oh boy is this a wonderful place to visit if you haven't been there you gotta go if you haven't heard about it definitely check it out it is remarkable it's located off the coast of the US state of Georgia that's right in Glynn County it's one of the sea islands and one of the golden isles of the Georgia barrier islands the island is actually owned by the state of Georgia and a run and it's run by a self-sustaining self-governing body it's a popular tourist destination the island uh, has beaches frequented by vacationers guided tours of many lands Landmarks, bike trails, walk along the beaches and the sandbars, all kinds of cool things to do there. The historical district features numerous impressive and incredible uh, older buildings from the late 19th and early 20th centuries. The island is also full of wildlife consisting of many different mammals, reptiles, and birds uh, that uh, hang out all throughout the different island salt marshes. In 2018, the Architectural Digest named Jekyll Island one of the 50 most beautiful small towns in America. And believe me, we were there and we would have to agree. We thought this was a wonderful place to visit and we're excited to show you this video. Please hit that subscribe button. It really means a lot to everybody on the How to Have Fun Outdoor Crew. Helps us get the videos out to more people. And definitely hit the like button. Uh, that helps promote the video. We really appreciate it. And let's check out Jekyll Island. Jekyll Island is located in Georgia and as you can see here it's famous for its driftwood beach and also the St. Andrews picnic area and beach area. It is fantastic and it is a beautiful area with lots of hiking, biking trails, wildlife and things to see. As I zoom out here you can see where it's located and it's just south of Savannah on your way down to Jacksonville, Florida. So it's located in the Southeast United States. It's great if you're coming down from North Carolina, South Carolina to Florida. It's a great stopping point before you get to Jacksonville. Highly recommend coming and checking this area out. Today we arrived at the campground and it's looking fantastic even though there is a light rain and we actually had this chance to run around the island and check out all the lighting. It was fantastic and I really hope that you enjoy it as much as they did. <laughs> I actually enjoyed it a lot. 
So tomorrow we are looking forward to a very sunshine day, uh, very, very bright. And we are looking to go to the different beaches, see the wildlife, the pier, and check out whatever great things there are in the island. We are really excited and we hope that you all enjoy as much as we are going to do it. And um, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to share with your friend. Hit the like button and uh, subscribe to the channel and follow us in this amazing adventure in Jekyll Island, Georgia with How to Have Fun Outdoors! We enjoyed camping at the Jekyll Island Campground. It's uh, very well located on the island. You can get to all of the bike paths easily. Uh, but we found the campground to be super clean, the service was excellent, everybody that worked there was friendly, uh, the campground sites were very large, uh, all the hookups were great, no issues whatsoever with the campground. We give it a five discovery bus and you should feel comfortable camping at the Jekyll Island campground. Those of you that thought you knew Jekyll Island Campground, well, guess what? Originally, it was the Cherokee Campground. That's right. Here are the original postcards from way back when. Pretty awesome, huh? All right, Aliche, we got Mr. Corbett here checking us in. Yep. And uh, it's a pretty awesome campground. It is. All it right. Is. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. They escort you right out to your campsite. Can't beat that. Awesome campsite, you ready? Yes, I'm so excited. This is one of the best that I've ever seen. So I'm super excited. Yeah, for this it's spot. just beautiful. The trees and the landscaping. And here we are. And uh, here is the campground and we'll show you around. Tomorrow's supposed to be a sunny day. We're pulling in late. It's a little bit of rain out there, but tomorrow we're gonna show you around. And guess what? They even have a little light show here. So we'll be able to uh, show everybody back home. We're making out with these South Carolina and Georgia and all these different uh, state campgrounds. Uh, we're doing well with these light shows. Yeah, they want to feel uh, the Christmas vibes and uh, we can find it everywhere. <laughs> it's so awesome. <laughs> all right, so these are some great spots if uh, you're heading to Florida before the holidays. And uh, we hope you enjoy this video. Please subscribe, hit the like button. It really means a lot to us. And thank you so much for watching. How to have fun outdoors. So the hookups here are great. You've got your water, you've got your sewer, you've got your power. And over here, uh, you've got your site boundary, your cable for all of your television needs. And as you can see, it's just beautiful in here. Gorgeous, gorgeous campgrounds. We definitely enjoyed this island and love the campground.
right, we found some friends from New Hampshire. That's right, folks, right here on Jekyll Island. And we've got Paul and Bonnie. Say hi to everybody back home watching How to Have Fun Outdoors. So you guys, I take it, come here often, it looks like. Every so, year. Yeah. Every Four year. Yeah. Six year? Six winter here. Okay. Awesome, yeah, awesome. We're done with the snow. You know, we like New Hampshire in the spring, summer, great. fall. It's yeah. <laughs> and then we come here for the winter. Awesome. Well, thanks so much. Uh, nice meeting you guys. Yeah, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll see you back in New Hampshire in the summertime. Yep. How to have All right. fun outdoors. How to home. have fun outdoors. <laughs> They've got, uh, you know, uh, all the typical rules, but when it comes to the facilities, 18 acres, wooded, full hookups, back-ins, pull-throughs, primitive tent sites, you name it, they've got the camp store with the food, ice, propane supplies, bike rentals, coin laundry, restrooms, fire rings, cable TV, as we talked about, complimentary wireless internet, you name it, they've got it, and all the activities nearby, biking, jogging, trails, beaches, golf, Fishing pier, tennis, picnic area, shopping, dining, and no drones allowed on the island. So, well, but, and there's some more. other rules, there right? Is some more, yes. For example, like a, you cannot have a four wheeler or ATV anywhere in the island, not only in the campground. A motorcycle are allowed only in the campground, but only idle. Um, but we have a good news. You they can use golf a, carts, right? Yeah, you can use golf carts that are quiet and they are actually cool looking around. Yeah. <laughs> and also if you need a Wi-Fi, the campground offer a free Wi-Fi that is a campground guest and you can enjoy it. And actually we used it last night and it was really good. <laughs> After our first great evening in the campground, we decided to treat ourselves and go to the Driftwood Bistro. Everybody talked about that and the food was outstanding. We highly recommend it. Definitely check that out when you're on Jekyll Island. Lots of great places to eat. And the next morning we got up early, uh, had a lot of fun checking out all the local areas, but we headed out to the pier and then ultimately to the Driftwood Beach. We're gonna show you that. And it was amazing. Hikers, bikers, you name it, fishermen, crabbers. You're gonna check all of that out next. And uh, as you can see, the ride out there was just beautiful. So sit back and relax and we're gonna show you around. Got a little bit of everything in here. What do we got here? Shrimp? Black shrimp. Wow. This time of year for the trout, the redfish. The trout are biting pretty good right now. They are. That is awesome. We're gonna hook them right behind the head. Yeah. Um, the hardest part on their body is their horn. Yeah. So you'll go right in between the brain and the air gills, or right in front or behind. Okay. So that way it'll hang right here, and you'll swim. Swim right out. And then you catch those big old gator trout. That's right. All right. All right, we got some fishermen here down in Georgia, and you guys got some fancy nets there. What's that all about? The bay in the bottom, and then you throw it in the bottom, and you wait about 10 minutes, and then pull it up, and that's when you gotta grab it. All right. So you have to tie the bait in the bottom. 
Yeah. And show him how it goes flat. So the, the trap goes flat. The yeah. The crabs crawl on the trap. And then when you pull up on it, the got crabs them. are in the trap. And that you is. You have to take them off and try not to get pinned. That is <laughs> awesome. Pretty cool. We need to do some crab in a leachy. Oh, yeah. And I'm ready to eat them. Let me know when you're done. <laughs> All right, Aliche, we've seen the fishermen, the campers, the hikers, you know, we've seen them all, and here are the bikers. So how are you guys doing? Doing good. Great. We're the bikes for the day. All right, you having yeah. fun outdoors? Oh, yeah. Where okay. are you guys from? Richmond, Virginia. All right, awesome. all right, very good. Have a great day, you guys. Yay. All righty. So who's the better crabber, the uh, son or the uh, husband? <laughs> Catching or eating. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I would be the better eater. All right. <laughs> Beach on Jekyll Island is really like no other beach I've ever visited. With all of the driftwood and the wood that laid all over the island, it was just a unique feeling like you've never felt. The island is really quite remarkable with its marshes, wildlife, uh, exotic beaches, if you will, <laughs> something you're not going to see every day. Uh, we really enjoyed it. The uh, Gypsy and Rocky enjoyed it. We had a lot of fun on Jekyll Island, and hopefully you can see it in this video. Look at this, huh? What do you think? I have no idea how it happened and I'm really amazed. <laughs> it is beautiful. And it's all out here on this beach. And 
And it is remarkable how these are just in the middle of nowhere. Jekyll Island has some amazing fun facts. In fact, uh, it is over 5,500 acre island with 10 miles of beautiful shoreline. That's right, 10 miles and only 35% of the island is developed since the land is owned and protected by the state of Georgia. You can actually experience what it was like to live on Jekyll Island as far back as the 1700s. That's right, you can visit the Horton House or the Jekyll Island Historic District just to get a taste. Jekyll Island boasts over 20 miles of bike paths. That's right, 20 miles, uh, making it one of the best ways to get around the island. Lots of hiking, horsebacking, but uh, for sure, uh, horseback riding, but for sure, uh, if you've got a bike, uh, this is the place to go. There's no traffic signals on Jekyll Island. Another great fun fact, in Jekyll Island's Georgia Sea Turtle Center is the first of its kind in Georgia. That's a must-see, and it's all designed around sea turtle research and education. It's pretty awesome. suggest you to every one of you to walk the beach but then walk the trail all the way back there are a lot of wildlife really pretty uh, landscaping and it is really really nice all right so everyone can see what we just did we came down here to the pier and then we walked this all the way around all the way down the beach all the way over to here and then we took this trail all the way back to the pier and here we are and what a great day that was uh i'm in a, love <laughs> a great walk huh and it is beautiful out here also two great areas are the beach village and the historical district so lots of shops lots of restaurants lots of cool things to do the beach village is all pretty much brand new they've got a convention center the weston hotel um, you know, it is really nice and we'll show you some of that with the light festival at night. But overall, as you can see, plenty to do here at Jekyll Island. From kids crabbing to fishing to hiking to walking the beach, uh, with the putt-putt and all the other activities on the island, 
Uh, we highly recommend bringing children to Jekyll Island. It's a great place for them to adventure and have a lot of fun. And it was great to see the kids out and about. Uh, we really enjoyed uh, our time at Jekyll Island. And I'm sure if you're a child, you would really enjoy it also. the wharf on Jekyll Island and boy is this super cool they also got dolphin tours that's right you can go out there and check out your favorite dolphin but let's go check out the wharf let's do it We got shrimp and grits. You're recommending that? Some really good seafood chowder and, uh, and some oysters. Now, is this some good food here on the wharf? Yes, very good. Very All right. Good. You're gonna love it, and you'll leave just so satisfied. <laughs> oh, that's awesome! I All right, <laughs> let's do it. Mm. Always great. some fun? I uh, am, yeah, but it seems like she is more ready. <laughs> Let's show everybody how to have fun outdoors. Jolly Jekyll Light Show is truly amazing. It actually made How to Have Fun Outdoors top five light shows for the 2021-22 season. It was remarkable. It actually is free. You have the self-guided tour and they did just such a phenomenal job. The lighting on the trees is just remarkable. And we overall, we highly recommend to check this out. It is beautiful. So here's some more lights from Jekyll Island.
hope you enjoyed the video on Jekyll Island. It is truly a gem in the southeast. Uh, we did a bunch of videos this year from South Carolina down to Georgia. And uh, if you want, please check out our Savannah videos, Merle's Inlet, super great video. We did the Holly Jolly Jekyll Light Show from Jekyll Island. Definitely check out that video. We hope you love this video on how to camp and how to have fun on Jekyll Island. We tried to give you a feel for the overall island and some of the activities. Uh, we really appreciate uh, the support. Thanks uh, so much. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Hit that like button. And thank you so much for watching. How to have fun outdoors.